Yo, Shipsman and back with another episode and it's a special episode again because I have teased about this before and it's uh, a box I bought from overseas. Ooh. As usual, I imported a box of chips from uh, USA again. I, I mean, they have some limited editions that I just have to try and also to get the box, if you know what I mean. Uh, these ones are super limited edition. I've reviewed once before and now it's time to review the rest that I didn't know existed until I just saw someone on Instagram reviewing the other ones and I just went onto eBay and click, 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 click and bought me a box of the whole three pack. But I can uh, reveal now that it's, it's not this one, but it's the companions to this, this one. We have uh, the Rick and Morty special edition with uh, Honey Mustard Morty. We have uh, Look at me, I'm Cheddar and Sour Cream. Yeah, Cheddar and Sour Cream. Look at me! The Mr. Me6. The whole three of the Rick and Morty limited edition Springles. Uh, I just had to get them because it's super awesome design and I really love Rick and Morty. So I guess I'll start with the look at me, I'm Mr. <laughs> look at me, I'm Cheddar Sour Cream. Because it's probably the most discreet of the two flavors I'm gonna review today. With the chips in itself, I, they're super smashed also because they've traveled like for half the world. Regular Pringle chip, nothing weird with the appearance at least. So let's go with the first taste. surprised they taste like Pringles I'm not the biggest Pringle lover I mean I like Pringles if I'm in the mood for Pringles but Pringles do have that kind of weird potato dough flavor that's a kind of a boring flavor and super Pringles flavor E. Uh, these ones I would say if you have tried the sour cream and onion regular sour cream and onion Pringles you pretty much know what these taste like they taste like that but with a little bit of uh, fake cheddar cheese flavor in a corner over there nothing special nothing weird I mean except for the limited edition box I'm saving this one but a uh, sour cream and onion still pretty much always works super middle of the road I'm gonna give this one some number later because I'm not gonna reveal it now because now it's time for Honey Mustard Morty! Also, normal Pringles appearance, nothing, nothing weird, nothing weird. So these ones are super accurate. These ones are awesome, or I mean, at least super cool. And they do taste mustard, and a lot of mustard. It is pure mustard, and with a really sweetness I get from the honey. I haven't, I don't know if I really ever tasted like real honey mustard, but I've tasted all kinds of mustard, and these ones definitely taste like mustard. The only downside I could find to these ones, except for that I'm not the biggest fans of sweet flavors on chips, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try to be objective, so the sweetness part can still be there because it's part of flavor. But the biggest downside to this, I think, is that they lack salt. I would love a little bit more salt than these ones to like elevate the flavor as a whole, but in general, Super cool flavor. I'm impressed with how well uh, mustard flavor that they, they did on this one. Kudos Pringles. It's like on the pickle rig that the flavor is super accurate, but the downfall of these ones is that they don't have enough flavor. 
but these ones do actually have enough flavor except for the salt so awesome made pringles and now it's time for me to give a score to these ones as i said look at me i'm a cheddar sour cream super boring but still you know always works so it's <laughs> two and a half yeah two and a half and for the honey mustard morty, just because it's a super accurate and super well put together flavor, I'm gonna give these ones a 4. And that's that for today. It's super awesome having all three now my little boxes here. I'm gonna put them on some... Probably gonna put them on display some place if I have place for them. I don't know. Ah, uh, whatever. So thanks for watching today, don't forget to smash that like button, smash whatever, press that like button and subscribe and follow me on Instagram and YouTube, everywhere, all the places. And I'll be seeing you next time. Bye bye.